with the popular Bible verse contained in Amos 3, 7. Surely the Lord God does nothing unless he reveals his secret to his servants, the prophets. A prophet is an authoritative person who speaks by divine inspiration and is an interpreter of the will of God. In the biblical days, we had prophets like Isaiah, Jeremiah, Elijah. Nowadays, we have other prophets in our time some controversies surrounding prophets and the prophecies they lay out. Now, the IGP, Inspector General of Police, released a statement cautioning prophets or men of God to stop legally acceptable, to adopt legally acceptable means of communicating prophecies to people. So different opinions on the subject have been proffered. Dr. Lawrence Tete had his views. Others felt otherwise. We want to understand these matters of prophecies a bit more. We want to see what goes into the calling of men of God and other related matters. And we've invited into our studio the general overseer of the prophetic Hill Chapel, Prophet Nigel Gazy. Prophet Gazy, good morning. Very well, good Welcome. Morning. Happy Thank, New Year. Happy New Year to you, Talma. I hope you're keeping well. By God's grace, and, I'm keeping and well. And a very good morning to your viewers across the nation and the world at large. We're glad that you agreed to sit with us. So yeah. We want to just understand this prophecy thing a bit more. Yeah. Because when people in the Christian dispensation talk about prophecies, especially going by the Old Testament principles, we know that when you see a prophet, it, it's not usually coming he's not coming to give you some great news but before we get into how a prophet gets his message as message across to people can we talk about you for a minute and talk about at which point in your life you became a prophet you have not always been prophet nigel gazy at some point you were nigel probably gazy. only nigel gazy yeah. when did th this change happen for you what was it about your early life that brought you here okay again very good morning to you and good morning to your viewers across the world and good morning to all senior men and women and especially the christian fraternity and my church prophetic hill chapel good morning to all of you so i i became born again at the age of 14 and I'm 38 now, which uh, normally my people don't want me to mention my real age, but I'm 38 now. So I, I started hearing the voice of God at the age of 15. Where was this? Uh, it was at Christian Matthew Secondary School. Okay. Yeah, we were staying around that place. That's Creamer to Christian Matthew Secondary School. So it, it, was that in Accra? Because yeah, it's in Accra. Accra. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. So that is in Accra. I slammed down. You heard the voice of God. Yeah. The what did God say? <laughs> so. You ask that basically I'm from Ekiapim. Mm -hmm. I'm Ekiapim. I'm from my paternally uh, latter, maternally educrum. Okay. And I'm the last of eight. I'm a family man. My kids are in the UK. And I'm the junior overseer. Him and founder of Prophetic Hill Chapel. So basically, I went to Lake. I went to Abokwa State College. From there, I went to Accra Poly to pursue purchasing and supply. Then I went to Legon, did my first and my second. And by the message of. So God. you have two degrees? Yes, please. In what and what? Um, first degree, religion. I majored in uh, that is studies of religion and history and mass communication. History and mass communication. Very well, so. so I understand the mass communication yeah. bit because now you're a prophet. But you studied history, you haven't pursued it. But talk to us about that voice of God you heard at 14. Or yeah, 15, so right? at the, at, by the age of 13, 12, 11, I was smoking marijuana. A guy called Anochi introduced me to marijuana. We come, I'm coming from that home where there's no dad. It was only mother who was taking care. So it was, he, when we close from school, he would take us to the Donna Railway and expose us to that quote unquote infamous stuff and so I started smoking marijuana. So one of the days I went to buy marijuana and I was hungry so I was going to buy Kelewele and a woman who uh sister Regina who saw the Kelewele said that Kwabna uh Yamiya do my new bra a chain me bra I found quite sorry and to me the Kelewele in a chow. So she gave me the killer for free. I went to church. And since then, when I went to church, I saw a man who is my spiritual father, where he's in UK now, Apostle Kofi Free Yamwakwe. So I went to sell at the far end because I already I was on I was high. very high. So he, he called me from the back there and he said that young guy who who is sitting at the back close to the speaker, the hand of God is upon him. So then I said, Okay, he did not know me and he mentioned my name. I was called Kwabna Ali. So he said, Kwabnali. Then he mentioned my mother. So my mom is called Abena Grace. And, 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 and I, I, I love it, admire it, and the rest is history. So that's, that's, that's it. So what did God's voice say? I'm very interested yes, in what so the I, voice I, 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 I moved from where my mom was staying, and I went to stay with him. He was then in uh, Adenta. I was his prayer warrior. So uh, he, he was then having his fellowship at uh, Accra Newtown, Piccadilly Cinema. 
then we moved to pick from uh, Toro. So one of the days, it was Tuesday service. So after the Tuesday service, uh, we have to go and we have to send the, the chairs back. So I was the only one who was packing the chairs. So I, I packed and packed and the last one, when I was going to give to the woman, my father tied the chairs from. As soon as the woman came out, then I had a wow in my right ear and i, I wow. yeah I, I had a wow in my right ear and i said madam a wow will not die and said, ah how 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 why so then she so a wow in there? A wow was the woman who was selling the chair's daughter who was then at 37 almost about dying so then she she ran to my dad and said ah, no so i hope i can speak to you yeah uh, uh, can you so that, that is but if you me. only heard a wow, how do you know that the, the voice was saying? Yes, so I heard a wow in my ears mm -hmm. and my 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 words. Now it's called prophetic utterance. As okay. I'm speaking with you, as I get high, I might be saying certain things that I'll not hear, I'll not sense, but my words. And that is called prophetic utterance. So the Lord touched my tongue at that mature moment and I gave her a word. And since then till now I went to school blah 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 and one reason why i went to school was because i wanted to be an inky prophet i wanted to be a a, a different prophet because at that very time on general 92.7 all the prophet they were not speaking good english and they do their gifts there, the, the talents were there they had me mega music that was a sofa precursor time in there but they were more or less quoted and quote a stock of laughter i mean the lended people the inky people they laugh at them so i said look let me take the chance let me educate myself so now when i have made to a doctor I've made that are ministers. I've made so you cannot just say that okay, this is okay, just a man of God. We we are man of God of class because if you are talking about sociology, we can speak to it. Every facet of the society, we can also speak to it. So we but don't. You, yeah. you have two degrees that you've never worked with, and yeah. unless you you've had some employment history that you no no I, I I I did my I did my national service at Mass, Ghana 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 Ministry of Defense. So when within that time I was teaching the the students that that is a, the soldiers who have their research to to asset where undertake I was teaching a CRS government and history and and some of them are maybe they are watching me I'm there so some some sometimes can call me a teacher because I was a teacher. You have qualifications in purchasing. Yeah, you've purchasing and supply. History. You yeah. studied history and mass communication. Yeah, the professor Pebby taught me University of Ghana. What qualified you to be a prophet? It's all qualified me to. Uh, there, there is no straight thing that qualifies me to be a prophet. It just is messes. He decided to make me his prophet. He being God, yeah, being this, the the uh, God. He, there is no clear condition that you have to fulfill requirement for you being a prophet. It is, it is his prerogative options to choose whoever he decides to be his clear messenger. When you got this call that you've spoken to us about, what was your mission? My mission is very three, very clear. R raising men of, on fire, declaring a second coming, and restoring people through prayer and the, and the two or the methodology of the prophetic. So my, 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 my message is just three. Where in all this does all the prophecies that you've made fit in? Because I, I like raising it. men on yes. fire, that's true how, how prayer. Does it? True okay. prayer. So every end of the month, before the crisis of the country, every Friday, all night, all night, but I've pushed it, we'll make it now once a month. So when it comes, thousands of people are lifting up their hands in aggressive prayer, the first century type of prayer. I, we don't joke, my child, we don't. We pray. I'm a man of prayer. We pray. So to raising men on fire. So you raise them on fire through on the ticket, using the ticket of prayer. Yeah, and declaring a second coming. So in it, I've been on radio and TV. Uh, for about 14, 13 years. Every, every week I'm on TV, radio about four times. And it's about the salvation. It's about Jesus. It's Jesus. Yeah. And I travel by the message of God. I've traveled the world. There's no continent that the Lord has not taken me to. Yeah. We are talking about prophecy yeah. and the claims that you make that it is God who is revealing these things to yeah. you. Does he tell you how to get the information across to the people as well when the prophecies come? Because that's what the the issue with the Ghana Police Service and the IGP's directive is no, about. You see, God will give you a word. Most of it, we get our prophecies from our five senses. Five senses. So all our five senses. Then we get our prophecies from trance, from vision. Mine, mine predominantly, I get it through dreams. About 95% of my prophecies are through dreams. So I sleep a lot. And when I sleep, nobody wakes me up till I'm up. 
So that's the time God comes to me most often. So I have diaries around me. I write a lot of things in. There are different men. As I become, we grow more deeper. Every prophet and the way God speaks to me. Like Agabus, God was using a belt like symbols it's called prophetic tokens and symbols but mine i mine i've gotten to a point in of in my spiritual world where it's my five senses as you are sitting there now i have picked something about you that i can see so my sense when you give me attention i'll just pick you you understand mm -hmm. and when i sleep i see most of the thing and when god tells you sometimes he might make, like example is one mp that was about to die i saw it about a week to the time he was he died and when I saw it, uh, the Hula Balu of Doom prophecy, the uh, p ignorant people would say that negative prophecies are Doom prophecies. That is ignorance. You don't know much about the things of the spirit. So I took a phone through a very uh, a man that a very big man of God, a very big man of God in Ghana, and I reached out to the MP, and he insulted me on the phone. Look at me, I'm a university of. A responsible church. I have judges in my church, soldiers in my church, serious people in my church. And I'm not coming to give you prophecy because of bread and butter. But the message of I passed that stage in the last 17 or 15 years. Bread and butter is not a problem. Then he insulted me. So he died. And I'll not So mention, you didn't pray for no, him? No, I will not. Doesn't God reveal to redeem? No, it's in never fact true. That, that statement is not entirely true. That statement that God revealed to redeem is, is not, is, 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 is it, uh, the Bible speaking in First Corinthians 13 verse 9, the Bible says, we see in bed and we prophesy in bed. There is nothing that is absolutely absolute when it comes to the things of the spirit. There is absolutely nothing that is absolutely absolute. So when a prophet of God tells you that I've seen death about you, or a spiritual person tells you I've seen death about you, and we say, okay, go and pray for me. Some of the prophecies comes with conditions. And whoever you are, if you don't subject yourself to the condition, the prophecy, if it's from the womb of the spirit, it will come to pass. Some prophecies come with that condition. But some come with condition. If. I hear people say that any prophet that uses if, uh, anybody, any prophet that gives condition. Because you're trying to give yourself a room No, it's, 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 what is it? For, for, these for words, error, for these words, is it? These words are carnal. These words are not biblical. You understand? We are speaking the deep things of God. We, you see, anywhere you see a prophet, where I am now, I brought heaven here. I'm not a pastor, I'm not a teacher, I'm not an evangelist, I'm not an apostle. Anywhere you see a prophet, the totality of God is here. If you give me the opportunity, I can prophesy to all of you here. You understand? So it's ignorance that people will be saying that somebody, no, no, it's ignorance. It's ignorant. And nobody, no kind of person should jacket God the way God must speak. When a prophet speaks, we speak in on, on the ticket of God. And what even makes it for somebody a prophet? Joel 2.25. It says, it shall come to pass afterward. I'll pour my spirit upon all flesh. And the sons, everything I'll tell you. Tell me, after the broadcast, or if you allow me to tell you now. A say I can tell you. A witch can tell you. But the difference between my good self and all my good prophets out there is that we are being empowered by the power of the Holy Spirit. Okay, so for, for those of us who do not have the benefit of this gift of prophecy. Very well so. And, we and are it's not everybody to, that will have it. And it's not everybody who very has well it, so. because the Bible is very clear that very the gifts well so. of God are many. Yes, please. And some teach and some do other very things. Well some so. offer service. But, but the good things about prophecy is that every believer has a bit of prophecy. Okay. Every how, believer. How do I tell? Yeah that somebody is a genuine prophet. Okay. I'm, I'm looking at you right now. Very I'm listening to you attentively. So. And I'm trying to figure out how do I know that Prophet Nigel Gaze's yeah. prophecies are true? Because some people think you are a false prophet. I, I don't, I, I, I'm not worried about those things. I'm not the only person. Even Jesus, I go to Israel every year four times. They don't even believe in Jesus. I don't care about those people. Who are they? They don't matter to what. Is I'm not called to everybody. The Bible says, and he said, I have called you to the house of Judah, to every prophet and the people whom God have called to. You understand? We have certain preachers, that, like, there's no way I'm going to buy uh, Benin, CD, this thing. I don't, he's a great man of God. But the fact I don't believe in him, that will not reduce him. The fact that you're watching me, listen to you, don't believe in Prophet Nigel. It will not reduce the hand of God on me. And it will not ask it well, what God will want to use me for. It will not, it will not let God stop whatever you want to use me for. I hope you get what I'm saying. Mm -hmm. But the people that have been called to, when they hear pay, Prophet Nigel, the Bible speaking in Romans chapter, he said, as many that are led by the Spirit are called the sons of God. 
So those that have been called to, oh, no problem at all. My church is always full by the message of God, regardless of what the crisis have gone through. You understand? This, the, it, it, because if it's of God, the Bible speaking in Ecclesiastes chapter 3, it said there's nothing under the sun that has happened that, is not, that will not happen again. And anything that is of God will stand. From 14, we've done this, then it's not a joke. If it's a joke, if we don't have content, I don't just prophesy in my church. I go to UK prophesy. I go to I, I go to abroad. Serious people, we prophesy. Even in the sky. There was a time I was in Ethiopia airline, and I prophesied to the lady that is bringing me the tea. So we are not joking. And anybody that has the spread of God will tell when you see some what is of God. And you read the Bible when you're a, a wedded person or anything in the womb of the spirit. You will know that this is from the womb of the spirit. If, if this thing is not God, then what is it again? What, I, what am I looking for at the age of 30? Yeah, we speak to power. We speak to president. We speak to, fo we, we speak to people. We speak to paramount chiefs. We tell them deep things. People that matter. So if this thing is not God, then what is it? We'll be listening to some of the comments you've made in the past. We've put a couple of them together. I like if you put it. Some of the comments I've been inspired to make. You've been inspired. But I don't do it on my own. I okay. So these are some of the inspirations of Prophet Nigel Gazi that he shared in the past. And we want to relive some of those moments. Have a listen. We will go back into the day. The Lord said, if the nation Ghana does not listen, we will go back into the days of 1983. 1983, I wasn't born. We don't listen. Ghana will go back into the dark days of 1983. The Lord, let's pray for the monarch of England. The Lord carried my spirit. And I go to Buckingham Palace. And I saw that there were a lot of flowers. And I saw that great England was crying. Let's pray for the queen. Welcome back. It's still breakfast on GTV. Daniel 2.22. It is he who reveals the profound and hidden things. He knows what is in the darkness. And the light dwells with him. Prophet Nigel Gaze is sitting with us looking at prophecies and his opinions and thoughts on the IGP's directive ahead of the watch night services. Prophet Nigel, sure, these are on. some of the things that you spoke of. It's, I was you inspired see, to say. You were inspired Very to okay. say. That's fine. When <sighs> someone prophesies hardships, yeah. it sounds very generic. Yeah. So what's the specificity in that comment? Mm -hmm. What is specific about a prophecy on hardships that should make um, an atheist, an unbeliever, yeah. believe yeah. that it is God who is speaking. Well, and why can't he speak to everybody? Okay, again, God bless you. And I salute my spiritual fathers, uh, Archbishop Jena, for we are the rest. You see, I was in Tel Aviv praying, and the Lord came to me, and he said, tell Ghana, so, so, and so, it was a conditional prophecy that if we vote for the now government, there will be cash, and it will be like 1983. This was last two years' prophecy, and even if you are an atheist, and you go to the market, you experience that we went through 1983 last year. So we, uh, that was a figurative prophecy, 1983. What does 1983 signify for? It stands for famine, it stands for hardship. And last year, I mean, you tell the truth. I know you go to the market. Things were not as it used to be. So it came to pass. I was there. Again, the Lord said, He took my spirit to England. And I saw flowers before uh, in front of their palace. And it came to pass. Somebody said, okay, uh, this, this prophet... But you is, said to, to pray for the, the Queen of England. At that time, the, the, what do you call it? The IGP has released his infamous... So you couldn't say no, she I, was... I'm not one of the coward prophets. No, I'm, I'm but not... some call you the nation's prophet. No, I'm not interested even in titles. So you're not a coward? No, I, you cannot be one of the hallmark, one of the signature of a prophet. is boldness and fearless. So where from... Tell us where Umofia is in, in, in the world. Where is Umofia? Uh, uh, Umofia is, is in Nigeria. But, okay. but on that ticket, on that day, it was an abstract country. And my intent was to criticize society. Why be abstract if you're not a coward? Oh, do I look? And, no, I'm not a coward. You see, okay. like I said, I'm educated. Okay. When the time changes, you change. 
You understand? When you read Acts chapter 21, 10 to 12, uh, Agabus came from Judea, and because he was not familiar with the system, he saw Paul, who was a senior man of God. He didn't straight away say that Paul is going to die. He said that whose belt is this? And took the belt and said that this person will be going to Jerusalem. And ungodly believers will kill him. And Paul, because he was a senior anointed man of God, he, he rubbished what Agabus said. And when he went to Jerusalem, ungodly believers killed him. And that was the last time of, we heard about from Paul. So when the time changes, you you also change like this year last year this year our I, I, I call a nation yeah yeah which nation is uh, it? i don't know so uh, so but you see yeah when it comes to prophecy yeah maybe because i'm from the christian dispensation yeah. I, god gave jonah a word yeah. and said go and give these people yeah, to this even. word yeah there has to be some specific. Yeah. Yem Penokre, yeah. it does not exist. Okay. So, anywhere so, in the so, world. So Amos, Amos was going to marry Gomo. Mm -hmm. And he would go and stand on the tree. On the tree. Well, in modern day, they say that, Prophet ah, Nigel say that the Lord has, I'm on the tree. I'm marrying my wife. They'll call me a false prophet. But it is the Bible. It's not in the Bible. Jeremiah just took off, when naked, with just sackcloth. Walk through that with, with ashes, walk through the principal street of Jerusalem. It signifies something. So, prophet, per the circumstances of the day, Romans chapter 13 says that we should respect authority. So, I'll be the last, I'll not even be the last person to disrespect the IGP's directive. Or, and I don't like if we put it like the IGP is like a person, the police administration, mm. and it is a Ghana police service, not Ghana police force. It's not Ghana police for it's Ghana police service. So we are all under the constitution, and every constitution emanates from the Bible. I hope you get what I'm saying. Oh, you're not getting me. Following your And so argument. you cannot be, I'm not, I cannot be a, a coward. It is God that inspired me. But the circumstances of the day we are in now, we don't like the truth. If we like the truth, though, I went to talk credit to do crusade last three weeks. Brim is like this. Brim, brim water. It's river worse than this. River Pra. Okay, that is River Pra. That's that what I want to say. This River Pra is. I went to Abuakwa State College. Now, uh, uh, what do you call it? Uh, Abuakwa State College. Inside Abuakwa State College, they are doom girl. I'm saying there. I tell there is no DC. I tell them there is no headmaster. I tell the authorities can't see that. What are we doing for prosperity? Yes, but even without the gift of prophecy, yeah. even without that spiritual also, gift, you you should be able to make these calls and, and, so what I'm trying and say, to say that wrong yeah, is wrong. So, 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 so why do we need by the message of God? By the message of God, I like I said, because I'm inky, because I'm educated, I'm bringing something to to conscientize society that the times we are in, yem penicre. Where your penicra? Ghana should not be where Ghana is. Your pen oh, can penicra mean penicra? So from penicra, your penicra. I get we don't like the truth, and I'm thinking of poor posterity. We see beyond now. We see what is ahead. Youth of today are not bold. We are not bold. We cannot. We we the, the nation we are in today. The time we are in, there's no truth on the pulpit. There's no truth in Jubilee. House, there's no truth. You just see somebody just came, just 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 they are entered into politics today within four or five years. They are when they are giving money is dollars and this and they are mass well. We don't like the truth. The Lord told me to take Ghana 70 years to come back to where we were in 2016. So we speak deeper things. So that's why I'm saying that the nation, the time we are in Ghana police service, Omon Penicre, see the Obian Penicre. And if we don't rise up to hearing what God is saying, our nation will go back and it will remain back and backward again. That's what I'm saying. Do you think, and um, some persons have made this point, Very that well. the Ghana Police Service is policing spirituality that is what and they, they want to regulate spirituality. That is what and they that are doing, but they the cannot case. do it. They cannot do it. Nobody can play God. And Ghana, Ghana, has, Ghana is a love nation by God. The whole world, the prophetic seat is in Ghana. And no, yes. no, yes, the whole world, no prophet in the world can be matched up to a good, genuine prophet in Ghana. They know no prophet. Some of them go to Nigeria, they go to South Africa, they go, they, no, they, they don't have what we have. But it's just that our environment, we kill our own. Our environment, we destroy our own. If some of us were in a different jurisdiction, this is not how we will be. We destroy our own. Ghanaians destroy their own. We have gift. The prophet in Ghana are good. Bishop Salifu, Usu Ben Pandere, Opokunsi and Dere. We are good. We can have character discrepancies, which is common to a journalist, which is common to a doctor. But that does not negate the fact that the hand of God is upon us. That does not negate the hand that the fact that God has called us. You get a serious, responsible people who attack the church, attack the prophet, denigrate and discredit us. So as when we speak, it might not be able to get into high offices. That 
that it has to get to. So a many a woman, MP4 Mon Penicre. MP4 Mon Penicre. Jubilee House Mon I was in one of the I was coming from UK and I was one a big person in this country. And I was when the business class, the thing that the person was saying, me were home on my Ghana. A very big person that occupied a very big position in this country. They don't think about us. They are not thinking about Ghana. Our leaders are not thinking about Ghana. And I cry for Ghana. When we travel, we see what is outside. They are not truthful. Most of the people in Jubilee, they are not truthful. They are not truthful. And it is high time we tell them that Ghana belongs to all of us. They are not truthful. You admit yourself that some of your own people, men of God, very well, sir. sometimes self-proclaimed, yeah, well, fall foul foul of the law. Very well, sir. So do you blame those who think the, the, the directive by the police service is in order? In effect, because in, in they effect, want to maintain law and order, which is their constitutional the mandate. The from the, uh, the police service, it is not a law. It's, it's not going to parliament. I've spoken to my lawyers. It's not a law. It is somebody maybe who want to just rub shoulders who just want to say that I'm powerful, just want to maybe on the ticket of people that have made name, you want to also make a name. You cannot gang the church. You cannot gang anything that is of God. But the spiritual things cannot be gang. Of course, I'm not saying that we should be out of the scope of the law. Any prophecy that if it's indeed is prophecy will not be something that is outside the law. Because every law was enacted and it came from the Bible. So if it's from the Spirit of God, it cannot be something that is, it will be inimical or capricious to the law. So it's just somebody rubbing shoulders that on the 27th of December, he or she is blah, 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 will just release a communique. And when they took one of my, prof my prophet, Jesus, I to, 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 to the court, and the judge even blasted the police service that where, since when did this become a law? You understand? And again, it is a political agenda. It is somebody's political agenda. They want to shut out the prophet so we cannot declare what God is saying. But how many times can you arrest all of us? And when you arrest her, how many months can you keep all of us? You cannot stop what is of God. You cannot stop what is from the woman of the spirit. Prophet Nigel Gazy, General Overseer Prophetic Hill Chapel, is sitting with us on The Scoop on GTV Breakfast today. We'll take a quick break, allow the prophet to take a sip of water if the spirit has instructed him to, and then we'll be back to continue this conversation. This is Breakfast on GTV. Stay with us.
Thanks for staying on. We appreciate all of you who are watching us across our social media handles, GTV Ghana. I'm sure the police service is also very actively interested in this conversation. Prophet Nigel Gazi, General Overseer, Prophetic Hill Chapel, um, sharing his perspectives on prophecies with us. Um, Prophet Nigel, we were talking about how the police cannot gag the church. So when the directive came in that statement, if I remember correctly, it was Reverend Dr. Lawrence Tete who came out actively to say something about it and to well, say that it was wrong yeah, and, and not, that that yeah. cannot be done. Very did well. you say anything? Oh, yeah, I, I did. Again, uh, wherever Dr. Lawrence Tete is, great, great man of God by our standards, the Lord blessed him. Yeah, so what he said, I read it on the internet. My media people brought it to me and he was in line. And we also spoke. We also spoke. I spoke on my TV. And my TV has picked the signal as well. So we spoke. If they will listen, they, is it because they don't like the truth, they will not listen. And all of us who, most of us, some of us will be exempted. Most of the people who are not standing right, they will, they will, they will, they will see the disaster. That's not truth. So for me, it's two things. Yeah. If God speaks to everybody, yeah. why, why, has, why is he not speaking to all of us? Uh, God, God speaks with every living creature, even bears every living creature. If I put you in a classroom for three, four, five hours, you become a prophet, maybe a minor prophet. As you grow in the things of the spirit, you become a major prophet. So from Amos to Jeremiah. Very well so. I hope you get what I'm saying. So there are things, it's called prophetic methodology. Like I just cannot come here and be, be like you, Telma. Be like this great man. You have to go through it. God speak, everybody that dreams is a way of God speaking with you. I hope you get what I'm saying. But there are certain there are certain signals that you have to get somebody that's operating in the office of the prophet. That is why journalists or the media must not talk to people who are not prophet about things of prophetism. But they might be able to play around it, talk about around it, but they cannot go deep. Because So we can tell, like I'm explaining to you. And those who want to listen will listen. It's not everybody that oh, 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 will to listen. Yeah. The other issue for me is why it's always doom and gloom. We know Nostradamus as the father of all doomsday prophecies. Yeah. But it seems that any time a prophet it has a word for people, if it's yeah. not hardship, yeah. it's death, every, it's catastrophe. Every good prophet, your signature is dealing with the devil. I'm not here uh, when I'm behind the altar, when the hand of God became cramped, became great on me. I'm not dealing with God. It's God using me against the devil. So when I see you and I tell you that, oh, Thelma, I see that you are going to America. That is for babies. That is, that is, that is, that is a dot. That is, that is little. But that's good news. Should no, we share no, good listen, news? listen. Good news, when you read the Bible every day, as the Bible admonishes us to read the Bible, you'll be having good news every day. But what you don't know, Thelma, is what they are doing against something I have seen about you, which is bad, which is from your maternal side. So you need someone like me, by the message of God, and any other person who is in the office of a prophet to tell that someone they are doing this, this, this against you. So when you get Isaiah chapter 38, Isaiah went to the king, King Hezekiah, and said, you are going to die. He used the word die. Is it not in the Bible? So when a prophet says someone is going to die, if you call the prophet a fake prophet, a doomed prophet, the Bible says all saints shall be forgiven. But that which is of the Spirit of God will not be forgiven. So and there must not be any private interpretation of prophecy. If I tell that, tell my meet me at the seashore tomorrow, come and have some waste beads on your leg or your hands or whatever, you check, is it in the New Testament? Is it in the Old Testament? No, it's not. So I've given prophecy, yes. I'm prophet Nigeria. I'm an authority by the message of God in the prophetic. But it is out of scripture. So don't fall for it. But if I tell you that, tell me, I see death around you. Believe me. Even if you don't believe me, it is better to believe and be saved than to die and be sorry. But some people also have issues with, yeah. with this prophetic utterance because they feel that if a word is given yeah, that is and it's not well policed yeah. for example Shatawale had an issue well, he's saying so. that if the prophecy goes out broadcast or I, I, I appreciate if you want me to speak to that I appreciate it to use a different person with the no same problem. circumstance let's, let's take so Shatawale out no, so yeah. let's let's assume that there's well, a prophecy about me well, so. and the prophecy touch hood is to do with my pending death yeah the argument for some is if it's getting close to the time when I should presumably be dying mm -hmm. or should die, mm -hmm. and that prophecy is not coming to fruition, mm -hmm. an enthusiast of yours may take advantage mm -hmm. and actually work towards my it, death. We are allowing to make it I, tell me, we are reasonable allowing, that your prophecy it, has it come has to pass. It has never happened, and it's, it's nobody professor to surrogate glory to himself. Anybody that prophesies for the purpose of fame, popularity, or surrogate glory, that person is out of scripture. 
We are telling you what the devil, the witches and wizards are doing, which by the message of, is, is, is revealed to a privileged few. So I'm telling you, believe me, by the message of God. If it means you, that when you get an, okay, I'm not reminding Ghanaians of anybody. I don't know any, I don't know much about showbiz or entertainment. I was on radio and the Lord gave me a prophetic utterance. That lady called Ebony. She will go to Bekwa area, blah, 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 blah area. In February, I'm seeing another person, Kasapa, called Keche Kwame Apia. The Lord said, they will die like Susie Williams died. I don't know her. Ebony is a touchy subject for me because yeah. she was a dear friend of a dear friend but, of mine. But, also, but the Bible also says yeah, that so Isaiah you, gave you, the prophecy no, to Hezekiah. Uh -huh. So why not go to the people see, directly? Why should you broadcast no, no, it no, on no, national see, television? See, we are too busy. <laughs> we are, you see, there, there are prophecies that the Lord will direct you. When, go to the person like Nathan was there. There are certain prophecies that for the sake of the glory of God, for the sake of the purpose of unbelievers, you have to proclaim it on the street of Jerusalem. So and when it comes to pass, if the person becomes disobedient and it comes to pass, we'll give the glory of God and it will bring the souls of unbelievers and those who are already believing, believers, it will set their faith up. So the only thing is that if the thing is from the womb of the spirit and it is biblical, it is in perspective of scripture, it is consistent with scripture, believe it. And I've been telling people that it's not only prophet Nigel, it's not only that, that prophet, blah, blah, blah. Go to a prophet you believe. There's not every prophet, it's not every prophet that will be believed by all. Go to your prophet that you maybe Reverend of uh, maybe uh, Sofu Samkran Chiankra, maybe Sofu Bedikobi. The prophet that you believe, maybe Prophet Makaya, maybe Prophet BB Freddy, maybe Prophet So that don't come to Prophet Nigel. You, but you have received you saw me somewhere. Okay, Prophet Nigel has seen something about you. Go to the man of God you believe. If the man of God has the same antenna, the spirit of God, wedded, and it's a pray, that person will pick it and work on it for you. Maybe just a common sort to of, solve the problem. Just a common kneel down. Let me lay my hands on I cancel it. Just one word. So I'm listen, I have young people around me. I've instructed them. I'm a prophet, but the message of God, you know him, it's a major one. But if you even dream about me, tell me. And when they dream about me and it's on the negative, they say, I don't sit down and say, me a prophet Nigel. Me, me, I've seen God so many times. I see angels on a daily basis. You've seen God? Yes, I've seen God so many times. I, wish, I, time. I want to know what he looks like. I'll tell you if you want me to describe him to you. Yes. Yes, the Lord came. So let me finish that. Mm -hmm. But even that, I work on, I pay, I sow seeds on that. If I get bad dream, if I get bad dream, I will not eat the next day till 3 p.m. I will sow a seed on that. I will engage God on that. So you be there and say, I'm Mr. President. Be there and say, I'm Mr. Boss. One of the next three, they are big boss. You were saying, I'm seeing that, I'm seeing that. You see, when somebody tells you, if the person is not even a prophet or whatever, whatever, as soon as a spoken word is released, forces of nature have taken it. You are from a, a home. They are forces of darkness. They don't want you to sit on TV. So um, uh, anything that has a living, uh, especially a man or a woman, or a woman, or a man who be born here, or a woman who is born here, Kobia Ujini Dio. Now, oh, I said, my sister, my son, I say, oh, I said, I said, I said, I and I said, I said, I said, but then when you meet even most of the man, every man, man, you see, if they are spiritually, the bottom, the home, the bottom, the dama, but then you be a honey, be a fear, bosom. In the Vianna La Paz, Oka Totu Mantos, now, but then say, I go see an accident, no, no, or the Cassa, or your bottom, so don't listen. A bad foul. So it's not to cause fear and panic. It's not to cause fear and panic. The good news is that all the home man yami now jina hamu ya fasting. Who sow seed? It's not all circumstances that you sow a seed. Now you see nyami pesu dini or nyango pon or tene no nyamu or pesu dini. He just want to be acknowledged. So acknowledge the first. Okay, nyami so phobia can say me a treme. Nyami di phobia can. And I say nyami akosu obi daye. There was a time I almost died. Watch this. All the pastors in Accra, all the people, the authors I'm connected, nobody saw it. It was a man of God in our village in Asamagasi Brikumaso who dreamt and saw that me be who. And I didn't joke with they say, Oh, I'm a leader of a church, and they say no. But if you joke with spiritual things, you will laugh at that la the, the, the bad side of your life. Most of you generally sometimes we read about you, watch about and you create you 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 ridicule prophetic, you ridicule things of the spirit. You are too little. Prophet and you see, you see, are, you see, tell me, you are not being consistent with me. Can it be consistent with flow? Let's you go. are cutting my flow. Let's yeah. go. Okay, let's go. I'm listening. I'm, I just try to understand. Yeah. You see, when you say people ridicule prophets, there's a there's a journalist in Joy FM. 
I gave a prophecy. No names. Okay. And then, okay, very well. I, I, I retract. There's a journalist in one of your sessions. Mm -hmm. I gave a prophecy. I wrote it on my Facebook page. Now I'm seeing a media has blah, blah, blah. They were insulting me. <laughs> the records on my page. It came to pass. Mm -hmm. So what I'm saying is that Obi can't be born here. Now, so they're too old. We are too powerful. We are young people. And to the own person, they be born here. Or they are catch their own. So far, we need it. And as soon as Jesus will be in there, they don't know young people on them. Because now there's no more evil in Judah or Samaria or Jerusalem. Go to God and deal with it. Like Hezekiah dealt with it. Your poor crew here. Peter crew here. I got to say for Judah, be shame come. Into whoever you are, you under prophecy. President, eh, president because of prophecy. We are afraid. Chief, that is all be all be all be true. I was sleeping in my my house, and the Lord revealed to me. I'm, I saw almost a judicial event. I'm going to say Justice Doche was the one. Then I saw a name your boy, and I put it on my Facebook page. We did one week and a bit more. Minimum more baby. You know that. Into the end, come Cindy. Near my need the embrace, near me a different one. My way, you see. So no, 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 no. A human being, a human being. And a home, a man, a abasa yeu, a ye juma. Somebody told you, I said, Matthias, I want to ask you directly. Very well. Some of your colleagues yeah. who are men of God Very well. have used this spiritual argument yeah. as a weapon yeah. to almost hypnotize people into certain beliefs okay. and, and, and traditions. We are saying that God does these things for everybody. He said, for prophecy, one by one, so that all may be, you know, encouraged. Mm -hmm. It comes to edify, so, rebuke, and correct. But for, to, for edification has become for edification of the pastor. People are selling oils, no, no, they are no, selling no. talismans, see, and they are selling sweets no, see, no and fruits God, no prophets. and pens and if pencils. If you sell a talisman, then you are not a man of God. You have gotten out of the scope of a man. A man of God does not sell talisman. No, listen, if you are a prophet... But and you admit that your people are, some of them are enriching themselves in their role as men That is of your God. word. To every rule, Thelma, there's an exemption. Okay. We have bad journalists that uses the pen to do diabolical things. Mm. We have bad nurses. But that does not negate the fact that Nyamie D4, the whole world, Ghana Nifi, and Ghana Nifi. Kafu will be reading the messages that? for us. Yes. Please, you understand that? Yes. Yes. You said we are the we have the top prophets. Yes, the top prophet in the world. Kafu will be reading some of our messages on our WhatsApp number zero five 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 six one zero three four. But um, Prophet Nigel, you said something I found very fascinating. Right. You said that you've seen God. Yeah. The Bible that I know in John one eighteen yeah, says no one has ever God seen God, it's not, only the it's Son, it's and not. only those who have had the the no, closest see, relationship with. Him. What does God look like? God can uh, okay. So to speak to it's two part question. Mm -hmm. I've seen God. The first time the Lord gave me my mandate. I was lying down with my son, one of my spiritual sons. He's now in Canada. And my bed shook. Shook, 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 shook. So I went into a deep, deep, deep sleep. Then an image came on the wall. The image was speaking with me and it was bubbling like many waters. I couldn't see the eyes of the image because it radiates. It's radiates like that. It's radiates like that. I was just seeing the forehead from this place and the hair is like a woo. Like a bruni akokurapa. It's in fita fita fita. And me hu ni nase keke. Ni nase te se ugwa mamba. So it speak, it speak into all back corner. Like a second. No, se me yera de mafreo. Kwe me juma. So that is how I saw it. When you see angels, it will be in the last state of you waking up. Before you see that this is an angel. Some angels have come in pain for the last time I saw an angel, like last two weeks. Or you call it, I saw it at a taxi rank. The Lord took my spirit to a taxi rank. An image, a human being was going entering into this thing. And the human that's why I had my 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 team, my, my 31st December team rest year of restoration. Then the angel, the, the so the image was a, a little image, a young boy, or share karma. Into or share taxi, my taxi need to pay wave him say. Then I saw the angelic wing and I said, Enchebia, Bibia be fine, restoration. So that is why this year my team is 2023 restoration. In Unji Bibi in there, that is why I say Bibi in there. Bibi in there. I'm fascinated about the angel. Yeah, I saw. The little angel that you saw at that lorry station. It could be an angel, it could be Jesus. Jesus loves the little children. No, it's an angel. Okay. Yeah, it's an angel. Prophet Nigel, we'll yes, take some messages. Yes, Cafe at the screen. 0555 
Mr. Day. Yes, indeed. Thank you very much. Um, two questions. Is, is what language did God speak to you? Uh, so far, any country I go, dependent on it. I was in South Africa, and and good morning to you. Uh, morning. You are one of my favorite guys. God bless you. I said you are one of my favorite guys. Though Thanks. you don't like the prophet so much. All right. So <laughs> tell me, I was in South Africa, so I picked the uh, Cape, Cape Town. I picked the microphone working. Then I got closer to a lady. Then I had Mataheko. Ah, say so, ah. So I said it. There's in, a Mataheko in South Africa. Yeah. So please. So I said ah, Mataheko. Then the lady stood up. He said, that is my name. I said, Mateko is a place in Ghana. So, sir, to answer your question, in Ghana, it's a, it's a place. But in South Africa, it's a somebody's name. I was in Sierra Leone, and they speak, they speak their language. I, I, I said it. I said it. So, the, like, I'm a queer that God speak with me in my, my LA, that is my mother's tongue, sometimes Chi, sometimes English, sometimes. It is his prerogative. It is in his bosom. How we are, I'm like an insulator. Every man of God, prophet is like an insulator. Is he black? God. Mm -hmm. No, God is not black. What color was he? You are, you are being, let's not be academic. Let's not be intellectual. Let no, you speak. saw God. What, yeah, what I saw, yeah. Like. So, let, so God can, God can come in any form. How did he come to you? So like I said, a few times I've seen him. You don't see him in your physical realm like this. He puts you, anytime you see celestial beings, you don't, any man of, any spiritual person that see that, even demons, you see them or you saw them in our physical realm like we are. No, the Lord will put you in a trance, in a vision or a deeper sleep. And that one, it's just like, it's a supersonic. Like a second, you see the plenty image. So when the image is, pa, then you see that this is an angel, this is God. So he can come in. But a few times that I've seen him, he's a man and an old man. But not black. No, he's not black. Why? No, I, the hair I saw was that of Bruni Abrewa and Nakokre Etinui. So God is white? I, I've never said so. Okay. That's your question. All right, okay. messages. 0555561034. Good morning. Um, um, Nigerese is just bluffing. One Ghana law is more powerful than his God and religion. The reason he's bluffing is because of freedom of worship. He should humble himself to the laws of Ghana and stop bluffing too much. Um, see how Tema is looking. She's even amazed about it. They think you are bluffing. So what do you think somebody like that? They think what you're saying is... They don't believe it. Mm. Uh, greetings. Uh, great reverend from me. His explanations we need more time. All right. Good morning. Uh, more messages. Uh, bubbling. Uh, this is intellectual dishonesty from Nigel Gazi. He thrives on vulnerability and poses as a prophet. We all remember when he hired people to be his family members and used them. Look who he's talking about, Noquari. Are you Noquari 4? Just ask you. God is out there watching us. Greetings to you all. Uh, thing of beauty is to joy forever. God bless you, Nigel Gazy. Papa, I'm proud of you. That's one message. Just to tell me, please, is the pastor trying to tell us that he sees God? Hmm. Okay. Uh, prophet is a true man of God. Uh, good morning, doctor. Uh, uh, please, I'm one who really believes almost everything through a book. I read the truths and myths of reincarnation. I want to know from the prophet whether reincarnation is real. God be with you with a strong, mighty hand. Man, a hunter, Franco Bab, new Edubiasi, 055-556-1034. Good morning. I think this prophet is from God. I like what he said. The prophet doesn't sell anointing oil, and that's what most of the prophets are doing these days. You do, you do, you do ask people to sow seeds of 12 CDs, though. What's the significance of 12? Yes, I was praying. The Lord told me that anybody we should sow a seed... 10 representing each of the months, 2023. Psalm 50 verse 5, it says, Gather them together, those who are covenant by reason of seed. So it is biblical. How much money goes into that momo? Is how many money? Mm. You see, let's, let's think about, somebody has a tumor. Mm -hmm. Somebody just sowed that seed. And, and the tumor went. Let's forget about, it. it's, it's little with a greater respect. You see, when we do that, Spiritual thing does not make sense and it can never make sense, regardless of whoever, whoever to intellectual this thing. But you ask for money. I'm not quite ask, regularly. No, I'm not asking for money. If you give me money, you have given to the spirit of God on me. No, but I have read from your, yeah, your, your Facebook yeah, very well that so you've asked for 12 CDs. No, what, what and I actually even sent one CD to that number but, and it came up with your name on it. Very so it's your number. So what I'm saying is that that is what you people do with the greater so some of the journalists or some of us who are the bigger platform. So as we mislead people, we don't allow people to come into the spiritual realm for liberty. Listen, I was, they, they brought a, a young girl about eight years to me who has a, a stomach cancer for the first time, stomach cancer. And I, I was inspired to let the mother sow a seed. And she saw that she put it on the altar. Put her hand on it. So much cancer is gone. Let's not serve God with our intellectual destiny. But why don't you just say, give me money? Why do you say sow a seed? 
Hey, because it's biblical. I've quoted it. But it's, it's, in the it's, Bible. it's money. Say again. This is you. Genesis chapter 13. This, this, this is what you said. It's not me. I'm this, talking the capacity as a prophet of God. This is so what you, those who I, believe me, those I'm, who believe... I'm asking as a journalist. Yeah, very well. Quote, if right. you are a pastor and you do not see the work of God as a business this year, mm. you will fail. Mm -hmm. I don't care how you understand it, but the church is not a business. And it's... that's why the Nigerians do well. Okay. This is you. Oh, yeah. If you're a young man of God and you're watching me, ministry is not like what it used to be. Mm -hmm. So if you don't have the business mentality, yeah. if you don't have an idea of modern positioning yeah. and composition of how business should be run, yeah. you run a church and fail. Okay. Are these Jesus' words? Yeah, these are Jesus' words because the best belong to Christians. The best. The Bible, the one Jesus, Matthew chapter 12, so when I was going to Jerusalem, he asked for the best donkey. When I entered, I look at your cameras, and I'm very excited that my TV studio has these cameras. Those days, they don't have that camera. It's not, it's not clap your hands and go down, buy these expensive cameras. Modern ministry, my ministry, modern ministry, when you go to Nigeria, they treat you like bank. The ushers are not wearing like a wayo garment and stuff like that. So, Kafi, you can't, like, I, for the first time, I was praying to God that when I leave GBC, I should not blast GBC. And I'm excited coming to a new GBC that I have, I've been seeing. When I went to your washroom, I deliberately went to your washroom. And it is one of the best washrooms that I've been. It's just like Hitro. If it's gone, those times, GBC washroom was bad. When I came to your studio, I've looked at it. It's not like, so we cannot live in the olden time. We cannot run ministry like the olden time. But some of you, some of the people, they expect that whilst I was coming, I should be on a donkey. No, those times are gone. I'm educated as you are. I'm, I'm very exposed as you are. Gone are the days whereby the things of God should be treated with disrespect and with discontent. In fact, the things of God, whether you believe it or not, God will still be God and his men of God will be men of God and the church deserves a better. If you go to Zenith Park and it's full of AC, you don't go to Ashen Chapel, you don't go to Reverend San Quan Church and there's no AC. The best ACs must be in our church. If you go to Jubilee House and there's AC there, the best ACs uh, what, the words I'm using, people, your facial is where you feel uncomfortable. Uh, so if you, that you are cutting, if you feel uncomfortable. So Mr. Kafi, so that is what it is, the spirit. Okay. Kaffee, yeah. More messages? A lot, a ton of them. Um, GTV let's, Ghana. Let's a few more. Um, Dennis from Ablekuma, please, can you ask the prophet on his take on the so-called man of God who says he's an angel of um, Afrosonopolis? Mm, All right. That's a big Dama, one. Tell the uh, Ghanaians don't want to be told the truth, so we should believe what the spiritual leader says to us. Some Ghanaian uh, prophets are found playing with our minds always. How can you wait to give lists of prophecies only on 31st night about only rich and prominent ones? They claim it's from God when a single letter from IGP shuts their mouths up. Good morning, Kaf. Please ask the prophet why I can find the nation he talks about on the 31st December night. Kafui, tell the prophet that God should strengthen and empower him for the things of the spirit can be understood by the spiritual people. I don't believe in religion, but this man is worth listening to. I love him. What did he use the monies, uh, the seeds mm. for? Okay. Good morning. I'm really enjoying this show this morning. We shouldn't judge because I think anything is possible when it comes to prophecy. How is he going to account for the 12 CDs to God? They tell us all riches are vanity, yet they are grabbing wealth. Achiman Mayor. Pastor. Pastors are using churches to do business. This is not what the prophet Jesus preaches. Uh, please, I want to ask the pastor, this, this Jesus, is this Jesus God, the Son of God, or the Messenger of God? All right. Uh, please, I want to ask the pastor the uh, same question. Good morning. You people are doing good work. Pa. My name is Captain from Nkwanta. Uh, it only takes the spirit um, of man joined with the spirit of God to know and understand the things of the spirit. God bless Nigel. Uh, what qualifies him to be a major prophet? Uh, you people want to know. Um, good morning, BFS. My question is, what is your take on the Bible verse that says, prophecies shall cease? 1 Corinthians 13, verse 8. Okay. Kaf, do you want to take a pause? I'm and done. then we'll, we'll be done. back to Thank take you. some more when we have them. Kaf, we day with your messages. These are your thoughts and not the thoughts of GBC. Prophet Nigel, quite sure. a number of issues have been raised at the screen. And perhaps we'll go through a few of them as That's time fine. allows. That's fine. Um, this claim of men of God and prophets being dishonest yeah. and basically, you know, Relying on people's emotions to get them to give money to the church. Uh, uh, tell what, my, what's your tell response? again, good morning. Again, good morning to everybody that is watching us and to the uh, the Christian world, the chief imam, everybody, my church members, my leaders, Mama Yeshua, Nani, for them. See, in the first place, you cease to become a man of God if you are taking the money for the purpose of earthly pleasure. What? Worldly people or people who are want to be diabolic don't know is that we take care of people, even sometimes more than even I'm using more than the Ghanaian government. 
So the money she collects from I have a Lodiba, to take yes, care of I have a Lodiba people. Foundation. If I tell you what we do with the Lodiba for the number of school fees I pay, the number of rents I pay. Yesterday, somebody was there around 9 a.m. I deliberately delayed him. He left around 12 midnight. We use the money. The money, we don't use it for ourselves. How much money will send, send But some baby. of your people use the money and that is for what themselves. I'm saying we that. see pastors that driving flashy that, cars, uh, uh, buying private jets. Yeah, we should and we'll be, we will. We, we, when we, your members are picking short to church. I have church. never heard that anybody went to Jay-Z's program in any of the state of O2 Arena and canceled HIV. When, but you come to us and cancel uh, HIV. If it's not for the prayers of pastors, you know what would have happened within around June, July in Ghana? If it's not the prayer and the altars of, of men of God in Ghana, so Ghana you, you wouldn't find have... it's justified. No, for I'm not. To no, what I'm saying, what I'm saying is that to, you see why you people are failing to appreciate it, that the father with the greatest of respect and uh, respectfully, the father, one man of God, is a fool. That's not me that all of us are fools. Me, at my age of 38, I've used, uh, GRE will come after me, but I'm telling the truth. We have used over millions of dollars to build for God. We have used millions of, do you know what we do? I, 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 we pay school. so we if they say that the pastors are using the money you don't expect that as lender that so you tell me you look good so you expect me that as i came i shouldn't smile i shouldn't look good but what is good for the geese is good for the it, it should not be good for the gander i'm just like you my mate who i went to lay with the deputy minister of information she was abu Bakar was my mate so i want no, to understand when we are hitting when does this become a job and when does it become a calling because you get paid to do a job a calling so no, so 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 we should drink water with a greater no we should I'm we just should, asking should, the should questions the, air. the members on the on bi bible say bible say except for to say no year jumano it did the way jumano bible say tell me that it's not in the bible and we don't care about hatred towards the men of god mm -hmm. the hate of Ghanaian, some Ghanaian are bad the church we don't care about that I salute Archbishop and all they say, we don't care who the is it the group group of men of god coming who you see will drive the best. Politicians drive Rolls Royce. They steal you and I are tax money. Give our money to their boys to be organizing entertainment program. You people don't talk about it. The media is silent about it. And when God, when you serve God, the God I said, the God of Abraham, Jacob, and Isaac, he blesses. Nyamishra. He blesses. God blesses. You don't, you cannot be a modern day Christian and you'll be wallowing in poverty. The blood of Jesus, you cannot. So we don't care about your hate about, we don't care about your grievances. What we know is that the blessings of God has no repentance. The call of God also have no repentance. And me, when God called me, he has blessed me. And this is just the be we are trotting. We don't care about the hate. We don't care about what they are saying. What I'm saying is that we are bad nurses. We have bad prophets till Jesus has come. Even in Jesus' come, we are one person, Judas, who was bad. In Jesus' camp, we are so to every profession, we have one, we are bad presidents. We are presidents that are corrupt. We are presidents that believe in nepotism. We are presidents that for within this thing. So to every profession, we are bad people. But that does not mean that we don't have good people. We are good people. Right. And we are, let's, do you know what Archbishop and Kawulian does? The money they pay, their titan, listen, Reverend Isu Anaba, I was listening to him. He said every month he needs 10 billion, 1 million Ghana cities. Send on the Nikon in Babidi. Tell me every month I need about 1.5 billion before we can sort our things out. What we things? Pay. What things need to be sorted out? That take 1.5 billion. Tell I want listen. to understand. Very well. Yes. My church, mm -hmm. when it comes there, the modern day church, the work we are workers who we have a working workers who who are lender people. We pay them all. We are working the our church. We have ACs. We pay electricity. We buy what do you call it? Pre. You can say we we are not sure we are so with the greatest of respect. Some patriots here said, Bible said, Levi form, yeah, yeah, Levi form, yes, yeah, soon, soon form. Bible said, Koye Juma, na fabre, ni yen shrao, na nyame fwa yon, no, na na pamne da yon, en bom mo hon bain, that is what the Bible speaking says. So, Genesis chapter 12, Genesis chapter 13, when Abraham gave to Melchizedek, so giving is biblical, if you don't give, you 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 be you be you you be a lipusha, you be a dwarf. So we are talking about modern ministry yes. and the fact that the church needs money to run. Very well. So, so. The, the law treats a church as yeah. an NGO, a non-profit. Yeah. But you are talking in billions of Ghana cities and sometimes in dollars. So are you scared of some, dollars? Zachariah says, "Silver and gold belongs to our God." You see, the problem you with the greatest respect. You see, anything. Let this phone. Let this phone. Be a wealthy for no problem. As soon as it becomes church, everybody has problems. You know why? Mm. Because it is, it is the work of the devil.
Mm. You expect that Dr. Leon So it's a spiritual attack. Yeah, it is a spiritual. So you expect that Dr. Leon will come here with all his sacrifices, then he will be dry with the greatest of respect. He will do a driver or truck or so. He was supposed, and he's supposed to come with even your friend is saying, uh, uh, motorcade. Because deputy ministers and uh, uh, regular human beings who, when they speak, cancer cannot be killed, they cannot give you salvation. They, they, they use motorcade. So why is it a man of God when we use motorcade and the rest, you people get angry? We pray for you. You home and come home. Madan, you need a bomb pile, mamu. Madan, you need a bomb pile. Can but you no, imagine no what? No pastor gives salvation, though. No, salvation no is of the Lord. No pastor is Jesus, but God has bestowed in us. There are certain things that the present cannot do, money cannot do, fame cannot do, education cannot do. But when the Reverend Superman pours oil on you, whether you believe in Him, you don't believe in Him. When He pours oil on you, He speaks. God, Bible says, "Yeah, kasa, ya mera diye jumaye." Into so far, no. Say that. And yet, can you imagine saying that last year Ghana come? Now, President Abeka said, in pen four, scanner of state, Faga said, a deep for now, so for or my women, you perceive Siamo, Monu Marade and Casa, second culture, service 17 verse 20. Or if my people are called by my names, I humble themselves. I, the Lord, I will come down and heal them. Let's stop the hate against the church. Let's stop the hate against men of God. Let be, there cannot be nation building without the role of spirituality. There cannot be nation building. Sister Tama, can I go now? I want to go. Let's let's let me ask you this. Please, you can ask because me. you're you you the, the church. We are still having the modern church conversation, also. and the fact that the church is also a business. You're you know employing it people. Tama, to so buy a land, should where my churches pay taxes with the greatest of respect? No, you don't. You don't. I'm, I'll speak to that. Okay. Where my churches? Do you know how much a, a plot of land goes? Mm -mm. <laughs> it's in it's in billions. The last time we bought is that is, is in billions. So you use the tithes and offerings. That is what the Bible says. When I pray for it after service, after what we are doing, I've seen something about you. When when I tell you and you are attached, listen, I went to Ali, is it at least Fiesta Royal Hotel. Mm -hmm. I was going to host one prophet, man of God from Nigeria, Joshua, Apostle Joshua Talina. And the receptionist, I was talking to a receptionist. And as soon as I looked at her, I mentioned, I said, You are going to have a kidney problem. My most of my church members, I know they are watching, my others are watching. After one and a half year, I was there in my Tema branch. The lady came all dark. All her two kidneys are damaged. I went to Fiesta Royal Hotel. The reception there. And maybe they are also watching me. They might hear this. Two years, they said, and come. I said, Madam, I said, my kidney are damaged. And he said, Sir, sister, I'm a bomb pie, man. No, ma'am, a thousand to say, Prophet Nigel, Freddy Dia, my bonnet, a chrono, and your baby you see things that are about to come. Of course, a prophecy the past, the present, the future. Did you see COVID coming? I, I didn't see clearly COVID coming, but one thing I saw clearly was that I, I and it's on tape. I prophesied that I see something that will shut the whole niche, the whole world into indoor. indoor. I, I saw that clearly, and it's on tape. The Lord uh, has pressed it on the president's heart to give the nation an opportunity to build him a cathedral right to build what him are your present a cathedral to the build nation. the na it's a, the national cathedral sure. what are your thoughts on that thank you very much and wherever the president is i salute him the lord bless him keep him well he has 23 months more to leave power the lord show him mercies so my candid position is that it is very good but it's untimely the cathedral if i'm a man of god of my sort anything that is built to god i support it but I was thinking that with the money president has made and all that blah, 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 is influence, he could have maybe cited a place, maybe Chibi, maybe Bali, and say that this is what, because it was part of his covenant. And that is one of the reasons why God allowed him. Because there was no way prophetically that he would have been allowed to be present spiritually. So when he went to God, so you go there, you say, okay, then you give it to maybe Jefferson Saki, Ujiyahi, let them build. When you finish, you pick one or two senior men or women in the country, you dedicate it to God. But the times we are near, kids' school fees cannot be paid. Bra, rim, whatever. You know the times we are in. So it is, on, uh, it, is, it, is, it is untimely. The National Cathedral is good, it's noble. Like the free HS is one of the best policies so far. And I think in the government, the government on the neck of that's the only thing that he can be remembered for out distinctively. All the others, I think, is abysmal. The National Cathedral are good, but it is not timely. That's what I'll say. Let's uh, begin to wrap up. I want your thoughts on why prophecies are, you know, we, we, the, the, the society is overwhelmed by prophecies only on 31st night. Why can't uh, we hear January prophecy? That is ignorance. This because, week prophecy. That is ignorance. Because, like, before I leave here, I'll give you a prophecy. I've seen something about you. I have Tuesday service. 
every Sunday, I have service. Friday, I have service. We give prophecy. But what it is is that the media doesn't trumpet it. The media doesn't trumpet it. So that is the only difference. Every prophet prophesies on a daily basis. We prophesy on a daily basis. But the, and again, the 31st is because even the 31st, anybody who is not even a believer to Elijah is saying, they go to church. And every serious person will listen to what the Spirit is saying to factor in their decisions. Like this year, there will be pockets of events, series of events. But it will not be so hard like last year. So last year I said it. Okay, Papa Naka, Wakaba you know So a sensible person will listen to that and take certain decisions and steps based on what the spirit is saying. So that's the only thing. It's, it's ignorant. And don't forget, I say there are some people that are infected with demons. To and their assignment and target is to making sure. And some are journalists. Some are people that have voices. And tell me, I see you don't like the truth. Make kind of crap, you know, I see. You see, and the target is that discredit the people who are speaking the mind of God. Mm. Block it. Block it. Don't let it. You understand? So, so as what God wants to do cannot come to pass. So it's a smear campaign. Yeah, it's a smear campaign from the pit of hell. You had a word for a certain IGP yeah. that this year his boots would be would be removed. Very well. So that, yeah, that is what I saw. Is that as yeah, a two, Dr. Dampare? I don't know about that. It's not Dr. Dampare. I don't know about that. You're not saying he'll be fired? I don't know about that. What I saw clearly, which will come to pass if they don't lift our covenants and they don't pray. You see, one thing about some of us is that, yeah, no, who whom you see? Papa, and as soon as you do, you are different, you are. Oh, yeah, IGP, I was a home, I said. When you're a home, why are you terrible in Chaka? Oh, yeah, President, me, 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 Consistently, what I've seen it consistently. Who did the Ebebem. And so my mom home pay. Oh my, they take it and they say step. Ebebem. Same as what he has here. Ebebem. So, um, Doctor Dampar, do you know him personally? No, Even though you said this no, prophecy I, I, is not necessarily I, 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 about you mean him. the now IGP. The now IGP. No, I don't know him in person, but I love him. I think that he, I love his dress, and aside that, I love the quality shoes he wears. He, he wears quality shoes. And. Incidentally, the prophecy was about his boots being removed. The shoes. Oh the, no, no, no! That is that a figurative like. expression. That was a figurative expression. Okay, I, I want to understand it a bit more clearly. No, when we say, I, I'll not go. You see, I'm, I'm like a judge. When a judge speaks, that is it. I'm a prophet, and I'm now a much more mature Are you prophet. Are assuming too much power? On I'm your not. Country? That is what you say. That I carry God. That's God. Can you imagine I'm speaking the mind of God? I don't know. I'll be, I'll be saying things about. It. If you want me to say, I'll say it. Not on national television. Very well, I want to and hear I'll them privately. That. And Very I'm sure that there are people who would want to hear their prophecies privately. You are not God. If God instructs, there are some that, you see, we are surrogated. When we do that, we limit the potency of spirituality. There are certain prophecies that, for the purpose of unbelievers, we have to hit it. Bam! Ebe moji tua. Send ebe obi ebe uns e nyami tu me ti asio. And ebe one man ebe ebe ame obi one na do hon e aba ne health ne way. I can never say it. Regardless of the fact that I can never say it. But some will say it clearly. And will say it with that really. There are some who think that you, you are afraid of Dr. Dampar and that he is actually the one you, you meant in your, in your declaration you see, that an IGP's boots would be removed. If the Lord told me that Dr. Dampar, you see, I don't know. Do, no, do I look like a coward? Do I, do I sound like a coward? Are you? I'm, I'm a spiritual man. I cannot okay. be. Uh, I, no, I'm not. And you see, his prophet knows me. They are his prophets. And, and this will be private. So this is, I don't want to talk about his prophet. Mm -hmm. But the institution that I saw, I saw that whoever is hiding there, if they don't pray. And it's tell me, sister, I am, me, 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 some of the diagra, ye be who or man we mo. And then the different so many me. We are we we relate. Me penasem me I'll cut Pentecost. Me need any problem. But Obi be Obi ba be fighting yami ejuma. Me fight it. Me kanya yami ejuma. Me kanya yami ejine. Prophet Nigel. Yes, Thelma. The country has a number of issues and problems. Very well. 
we don't want to hear the, the doom and gloom. What, what are the hopeful prophecies? For example, there's a Galamse problem. Yeah. This is River Pra. We are trying yeah. to fight it for a long time now. Yeah. What is God's word on how we can beat this? Because God is too busy. He's that, too busy to think about, the, about the natural resources that he blessed because, us with. That are being yes, you see, decimated. When, when, I, when I came here, I came with my son's car. Mm -hmm. He drove me here. Okay. I did not, with the greatest of respect, I did not fly because I'm Prophet Nigel or just in the spirit appear here. God has given us common with the greatest of respect. Again, greatest, greatest of respect. God has given us. So are you telling me, say, I am for no more I am for more pra Don't they see it? Into God, no prophet, God do not go inspire any prophet. Say, 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 in so no cry home the woman, say in so no more buffu, no or crashing pain for Nina. Because and pain for Omo dear bro, me say me kwa bua kwa state college. So kwa busko brim on brim. I yet to say, I yet to say to Komilo brim and not two thousand the year two thousand. You could you see, you see, and no one says, I remember, remember, says, I remember, me casa on penocre. Says, I brim on a busko brim brim net that busko etino. Omo ye gallem say, oh, last year I call up back who we a student back who we I would have seen that boy's prefer of Abuakwa say the year 203. Me, your compound, complex compound, etchile say, compound in here, etchile say, ye two gallon. I didn't tell him so change in him with the greatest of respect. I just said DC own in him. I just said MP own him. In the way, now members inspire, near Radi a yichle and Norma Akata. We reveal hidden things. This is not hidden. So you can't see GBC, I'm daring, young for your camera, and cop with a pra. We've been there. Yeah, so this one, I tell them that with the minister for the event, I I will not dare the president is saying that I contact, I contact, blah 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 with the great they will say I'm gonna make cock But truth is not in this nation. I'm a castle of the make cock beyond me make a contact. Professor, one of the one castle guasumo, or my castle guasumo say that I'm on penicre, or my gun I am penicre. Prophet, what can the nation you see there's a there's a generation of people who because me make us and no makasa whoever is talking to you no catches on jan or yes and oh tell me but we are looking at the time on the home casa home nan in a casa from Nigel we are we are talking because we are we are quickly running out of time that's why they are prompting me to keep an eye on the clock I want to know what your word for the nation is you are, your pastor is a good pastor. Don't say that. Me no kasa ni omo kasa guasum. Omo me 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 no kasa ni ame me kasa. But that's for whoever is there. I mean, Shano. Amen. Entertain me. What's your word for the nation? The word for the nation is that this year will be good. The word for the nation is that baby bia oye juma oye ganeni. Don't yame fa yusu so kano ajengwa. Ofa ni so kano ajengwa. Obi bia because of COVID no unqua sorry unqua sorry. Number two. Yen fa a juma ding, yen ye juma ding, yen ye de vein, a juma ding, ye de vein, a juma ding, ubia wherever you are, hard work. Uko Asia, hard work. Uko Asia, anytime I call China, um, omu nim sande, omu nim hard work. Ubia hard work. And I yen take politicians, no, omu um, take corruption, so. Journalists for Enkanukre, I saw for once yen, yen canukre, IGP, Enka on omu um, targeting Croft, ubia and canukre. Sempa chotty as uh, MP or uh, no attack here, D for I'm sorry. Or no, young comes at the optimical. I'm sorry. Yen can you cry on my way more? On my way more, near your papa, near see and yet near a year born in a year see a year into a man way and penicre. So say, President of Ghana, be penicre, and ye. So say, Speaker, be penicre, and ye. So say, Judicial, be penicre. So, your problem as Ghanaians, yen penicre, yen dinu cry my own. Say Ghana ni unse ni nyonko Ghana ni yeya. They will go head to toe to destroy it. But baby, I'm a kasa all your phones are no. No one kasa wash your phones. So yeya ni say ya. Ebi yeye. Any yebe. This year will be eventful year. Me ni ame kana say. Yeah, me who bibi Sunday me bo ampa me who bibi. Yen strengthen yen nothing sector no. Jomoro Boku area ho. Jomoro home ne ne me kasa wo. Me who dada kusiara no ye. Jomoro is in the Jomoro, western region. Jomoro, me, me, Jomoro, me, 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 Jomoro, me, 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 me,
and a baby, no master, ambassador, but Guinea ambassador, no master, and then they call Kim Pisky. And also, I started project with Brews at the end into a quabba, no name of the Casa, Naya, you are too chum. Say that in English because Guinea, maybe they might not speak. No, so what I'm saying is that the former president of Guinea, Alpha Conde, he came to Ghana, I think, last two years, and they took me to him. And I said, sir, I'm seeing that they've taken your shoes, blah, blah, blah. He said, well, I've started something in a brief area, so I'm going back. I'll come back to Ghana. Then we'll deal with it. Or call pet and you could see me. So they took his shoes and yeah. he, he was, yes. there was a coup. Yeah. And now there's an IGP whose boots have also been removed. You want to put words in my mouth. I distance myself from that. Okay. I'm saying that you might hate me. You might not like me. I, that, that is fine. I have people that will love me, that will like me. Mm -hmm. And if I if you don't, I have kids. My kids love me. Fine. What I'm saying is that Yembo or man pain who buy the who no my baby because of a bomb A bad democratic system is better than a political disorder. So, soldiers, everybody, let's become not a munti. Say, say, almost did be brains here, cause a munti, but a munti near home home aircraft. Almost off on our bound, they be a mountain kind of crunch, or by yea, you soon so my dear. Well, more by any session come and more by Jomoro area, Jomoro area, or northern sector, and I yea, papa, or mom bon hobby, and I mean, or baby will crumble or a pain or no see a bon hobby. The battle of my cassa be brave, make a cassa be brave. Now, um, when we talk about people dying, this is my very last question, right? You always prophesy that people will die. Do you know when when you will die? Has when God me, told you when, when I'll die? Hmm. Is Has it, God told you? When I've seen, I've seen about three times. And you never died. No, what, if you allow me to finish, yes, sure. I've seen about three times. Uh, other people have dreamt. Even last week, somebody wrote on my Facebook. I dreamt that I've had an accident, and myself, I saw the Lord took me to the graveside, and I was crying by a grave. I'm a young man. I'm 38. May God forbid. Death is my benefit, like Apostle Paul said, and I have satisfied all righteousness at my young age. 38 na maya merade se nya me frem na medana se but a no merade aka fa me ne waye a kire me no me hu ni na ye ye start to cry you do 10% here inti ye be di de be bring a no ma be bring o yenim but same po some be mu po because e yen come say na na be mu be bia me do de bia me ka se say oti se me wo mo nto ye ho waye ye waye o din na ye kan fo o din na ye kan fo Ah, mama brass band India ni na monto sanu. Bwas a bra ma bra u nyamie juam na so me send jina me na soa. We bless God. Ma wini so be brain. Me say I sorry that every. And I mean young we because be brain ni ya a radi akafamo. I say John Muhammad be president. I can't wait for that time. I'm waiting for that to see that. Into me young we. John Muhammad has been president already. I say obesa a president or my gan emo. Into me, I'm waiting for that prophecy. Now, Mr. Master, I've caught the whole world. So, I said, I'm not in by it. me, the minion, and I'm a wood, and now heaven is at lost. Because you're a castle more show. To me, the minion, we but empo because too many are holding a radia. So, empo now, me frame ya. Now, me, I be, me, then I say, the baby of me, free as a man can see, because me, my metal body and a bunch, me, papa, driver, common driver, baby, a radidim, me, you know, me, then I say. Before we leave you, finally, we have two minutes to roll the end credit. You yeah. have come to GBC. Yeah. What should say something about GBC? Oh, I'm, what I'm, is I'm, our... I'm so <laughs> I don't know if the word is flabbergasted. Is it flabbergasted? Yeah. I you see apart from your external buildings which need paintings, GBC like you know I've been to BBC before in England. I've been to TV. Yeah, I mean, you are top notch. I mean, your washroom, good. Now you're presented and you're presented and not old people and the rest. I mean, I'm seeing young people, quality people. You understand? Like a few who doesn't like me and the prophetic. You understand? So, I mean, GBC is good. You are good. You are so, good. Look, I, I look at you're looking at the GBC is in the guitar. That means your Minister of Information is in the guitar. For once, I think that I'll give it to him. I'll give it to him. I'm General Overseer. Yeah. Prophetic Hill Chapel, Prophet Nigel Gaze. Yes, thank madam. You I also thank for you for sitting with me. It's a great pleasure, and I thank you. Thank you and so much. And I wish Ghanaians a happy new year. All my fathers of faith, I cannot mention all of them. My spiritual father, Apostle Kofi Efriya Mwaku Eyim, Sofo Titi Brim Kennedy, all the men of I love all of you. 
Asofo, be everybody, including your pastor. So I'm out. Thank you so much. <laughs> Prophet Nigel Gage is sitting with G. Thank